you know, given that, you know, I'm in Canada and I, you know, I would have to say America today, you know, okay. because Canada and America kind of, you know, they're brothers in that show, so. <laughs> right, I'm surprised I'm not getting my butt kicked all over this country right now for calling you America's hat. <laughs> oh my god, you are? No, she's going to apparently kick my butt. <laughs> what are your opinions on <laughs> no, you don't. That's a fake address. Right. And she leaves. You know her? <laughs> You're the fiance? Get out. <laughs> okay, you can stop. You can stop. Harmless fiance. <laughs> Tragedy for her. <laughs> uh, okay, yes, your question. What are your opinions on people who make you lose the game? Um, can you do your Yuki voice? I, 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 I can if you go punch him. <laughs>
got change? My relationship. No women for Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Good, Nobody knows. All right, dude. In uh, Dragon Ball Z, what was your favorite line to uh, voice? What's my favorite line? Yeah. You mean of, of all Trunks' lines? Yeah. You know, because I also played the tournament announcer. Oh, Trunks' <laughs> Of all Trunks' lines? Yeah. Most of my Mario, um, the one you like best? The, the, the line that I like the best. Uh, yeah. I don't know, because some of the lines I liked better in Kai than in the original Dragon Ball Z. And that's not all out yet. Can we get an, ex an example? An example! <laughs> oh yeah, I'll just tell you the line that I've said for a thousand years. Um, I, I said it every con all the time. I would always say, um, You're about to find out what it's like to fight a real Super Saiyan and get a line read from a real voice actor. <laughs> Everyone would recycle. Period. Yeah. Okay. Everyone would have a compost heap in their backyard and rain barrels attached to their houses, okay? Some yeah. Love those rain barrels. Boo! Yeah! Boo, Mother Earth! You know? Um, and uh, everyone, everyone would eat their vegetables. What? Meat-eaterian. Meat-eaterian? Meat Woo! You go to the bathroom. <laughs> Quickly! You need the vegetables to make it all, you know, happen. That's part of the process. It's called fiber. You need it, the fiber with the meat. It works together real well with the meat. Use so. the meat in the, the vegetables. Fiber on Mars. Yes, dear. Um, I was wondering if you could make up a funny story on the spot. <laughs> Baby, I don't need to make them up. <laughs> I can tell you a real funny story. Yeah. It's true. Yeah. Yeah. I, can tell you, I can tell you funny stories that are 100% that are true, and the truth is always stranger than fiction every day of the week. Okay. Yeah. Do it. Yes. You want to hear the weirdest story? Yes. yes. Ever? I like yes. that story. Yes. All right, here you go. <laughs> There's this chick with purple hair. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I was doing a convention in Sydney, Australia. I had taken my wife with me. All right. Um, there was uh, there was two days of signing. The first day of signing, I show up to the uh, convention floor, and there's a girl standing first in line, and she has a letter in her hand, and she's real nervous. She has a lot of things for me to sign, and she hands over letter, please, Eric, would you read this letter sometime? I'm like, yeah, you're really cute. That's nice. I appreciate it. And I sign all of her stuff, blah, blah, blah. She goes on her way. That night, I go back to my room, I open it up, and I read the letter, and it's weird. <laughs> it's like crazy person weird. Like Kevin Spacey in seven. Oh, I'm crazy. What? Spacey. Go rent the movie seven. Oh, no. no. All right, then Don't I know. Do, do that. I heard no, so I'm going to go with that. Right. So, I read that, and it's like, um, you know, I, I, I wanted to come down and meet you. My husband said I shouldn't. My mother said I shouldn't. But I know that you and I could be friends, and I knew that you and I should be together, and all this kind of weird stuff. And I'm like, what? Okay, whatever. She already got her autographs and stuff, and maybe she won't be there. No, second day, she's the first person in line. She has another letter in hand. Okay? That's right. So, this day, the second day, I brought my wife to the convention with me because she was going to go buy something in the dealer room for our son. Well, I'm signing in the dealer room, right? It's an 